can some people exist before they are allowed to be free? How many times can a man turn his head, pretending he just can't see? The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. The answer is blowing in the wind. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. The answer is blowing. Good morning, Karina. Say good morning. Labrit. 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 Yeah. Here we are in Riga. There you are, Joanne. I was just saying, you want to see the lovely breakfast she has said. Good morning. <laughs> Labrit. <laughs> Labrit. <laughs> morning, Centaurus. <laughs> oh, that is so beautiful. <gasps> so plentiful. sketching in the cemetery in November this year. This is Buffalo. Downtown Buffalo. Try. That is from the site of the Lake Erie. Lake Erie, right, right. <laughs> it's good you know that. The city hall, the Hilton Hotel, etc. Again, a little typical Buffalo. I mean Chautauqua, Chautauqua porch. This is in the fall. It's an apple um, farm, apple orchard. They're putting the apples into baskets to be shipped out. Western New York is uh, a great um, fruit and vegetable growing area. This is the um, main administration building at Chautauqua. This is Dr. Brett's office. President of Chautauqua? This is his office. Wasn't your show last summer? The exhibition of this 
Rosenthal student artwork is right in here. This is beautiful. All in this big exhibition space. These two I did from photos that I had, that I, I got when I, last time when I came here, of course you recognize. <laughs> I mean, this side is like an A-wall here. I think, uh, uh, it, it, is it just the space, not, not including over there? We shall be in that space also. This is the first time I've been in public. It's not a special event. It's a very special event. It's a very special event. It's a very special event. In other words, we'll just let them go to work and then we'll come back. And then they'll show you. Oh, sure. I don't know too much about this. Bravo. This is the Freedom Monument in Riga. It was built before the occupation in 1940. People come and place flowers. Notice the arrangement of red, white, and red, which is typical of the Latvian flag with the red, white, and red stripes. There's a lot of construction right now as we were there in Riga. We went to the department store to buy bath towels, but there were no towels in stock that day, so we decided to buy yard goods. Two of each? Pay here, we pick up later. It's called pick up and pay. Okay. Um, color it when she cuts the white to make it two meters all in one piece. Two meters in one piece. Wait, what's your, what, 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 what? Oh, three meters. Three Yeah, they do this for me, too. This is two meters already, right? No. Two meters here. Studio. I can also want more room for guests. No, we don't. Have <laughs> <laughs> it's for me. Nice. Yeah, I think George May for Clement Yuris. Wait, my rock's not that nice.
We're at the opening now. And these are students from the school. They are listening to their principal, Mr. Zach is speaking. And this is the assistant principal, Anita. Valdez is translating for me. Mr. Pumpers in black is the vice chairman of the Friendship Society. And this is the president of the Art Academy. That's Harry, our musician friend. And there's another newspaper reporter. Sylvia Littema is in white. She's the one who invited me. And that's a newspaper woman in red. This man is the president of the Watercolor Society. And the girl in the plaid jacket teaches Russian in the school. And these are other teachers, a student right there. And this is Maya, the principal's wife. I have a letter from the principal of my school in Clarence, and it is addressed to the principal of the Rosenthal School. I'd like to read it. Okay, so just kungs, my little speech, I'm so called. This letter from Terry Piper indicates appreciation for my visit and further exchanges of student artwork. It invites teachers from the Rosenthal Art School to visit us in Clarence. The letter also suggests that perhaps in the future students can also visit our school and live in our homes. All of this to continue to improve relations between the U.S. and the Soviet Union and also to inspire understanding among students in both countries. And I firmly believe that it is through the young people, through the eyes and the minds and the hearts of the young people, that we know tomorrow looks very, very bright. I would like to present to the Latvian Friendship Society my gift of this painting. We moved to a classroom then where I met with the students and presented gifts to them from Clarence.
Each April, around the 20s, uh, we have an annual arts festival here in this square at the Dome Cathedral. Now, and this uh, painting was done by the students of our school, art school. The national costumes and the black jacket, That's it's very right. symbolic. A real dichotomy, <laughs> right there. Yeah. These would be as old as Vatskavetsri Krispa. Yeah. 
<laughs> the general impressions of Americans are just fun, uh, laughing, good, nice, and this sort of thing. Snakes. Yeah. You got it. I saw you on TV last night. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he did? How was it? How did In it go? TV, I saw. Really? How was it? Quite impressive. How was it? Oh, okay. fine. Very <laughs> fine. <laughs> well, Jonas Rosenbergs was one of the jazz musicians at Chautauqua last summer, who we all got to know in the golf club and jamming sessions. <laughs> Every night. Very Every late. night. Late, late, late. Very late. Yes. Very late. Yes. So, how many we visited St. Peter's Cathedral which has been turned into a museum. Mm -hmm. It looks like there were. <laughs> On our way up to the steeple, we came upon this couple being married. <laughs> And the main thing is that they are turning all the time. Mm -hmm. And uh, what they say is that if a witch comes into the room, then it stops turning, so you can <laughs> recognize her. <everybody. laughs> and it's a tradition that the new bread come come here and put flowers to the grave of Turai the Rose. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I'm afraid to say something definite, really. I'm not sure about. Uh, she's looking for the ins I'm looking uh, inscription. For the place where my yeah. father uh, carved his initials and before he left Latvia before World War II. And I think this is it here. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. That's very good. <laughs> this is the oldest house. This is how the houses were built in the Middle Ages. Yeah, these are things. <laughs> these are clearly things. We visited the studios of the Art Academy, 
where the students are preparing their final projects. My voice and sound of that feels really not we also had a guided tour of the Applied Arts Academy. Sort of center as well. We had afternoon tea at the principal Andres Zaches studio where we viewed some of his paintings. Our agenda was filled with visits to a variety of Latvian artists' studios. <laughs> well, we, we could earn in strong agri-currency here. We, uh, I mean, we have facilities, well, good enough to earn some currency. You could, well, let's say, sell ice artwork, and we have a lot of artists here. Uh, yeah, but the, up to now, all the currency uh, remained in Moscow, which was coming to the Soviet Union. We didn't have, we had very little of it. This is the kitchen. Yep. Wow. Let me graduate out of the great work. Your co operative conference was six months, so sharing much. Wow, that's so nice. It's very 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 the old architecture. So uh, that was a sort of, mm, that was you know well those who those who were willing to could take part in this sort of competition because the best posters will be also edited. Mention so this is my work here though. <laughs> This is an emblem of Riga, and the title of this painting is A Town in the West of the Soviet Union, meaning that... On the last day of my trip, I had the privilege of meeting with the chairpersons of the Latvian Friendship Society, who had invited me to have this exhibition in Riga. <coughs> May your children, your students are as happy as ours and let our students be as happy as yours. We hope to see you again in our city. How many people are together? Teachers and students. Okay? Uh, well, I think ideally approximately six students and two teachers. Ideal would put a such student do school. I could consent. Are you going in for some politics? Or some God no. <laughs> no. 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 I heard the word. Absolutely negative. Positively not. If the question is if I'm going into politics, deliver me from that. It's a deep school. Speak English so I can record it, okay? It's in but. She's presenting herself. She has just returned from Leningrad. I've got some news about the situation in Leningrad.
They are very positive about our proposal of the, making a demonstration on the 14th of June. So they will make their own demonstration at this, on this uh, date. Someday it'll come true 